I am Toussaint Henry. And I'm Kenesha Henry. And we are the proud owners of Henry's, Henry's Family, Family Farm. Farm. Mid-City Farmers Market is located in, in a very central area of Huntsville. It's a destination place. It has a little bit of everything for everyone. And I see a lot of people walking around with their dogs. The dogs can come, guess what? The children can come. <laughs> Why? Because there's activities there for the children also. Hi, I'm Heidi and I own The Baking Fist. What really sets apart the market at Mid-City is that it is cool. So you get to go get your shopping done at the farmer's market, support tiny businesses, and you get to listen to live music and try delicious drinks at the bar and try some of their great food. What's really nice about the market at Mid-City is it has such a long season. It's open all the way from March until November. My name is Artie Dean. I am with the Camp Counselors. We are a band that plays at the camp here in Huntsville, Alabama. We've got a beautiful facility here. If you can see behind me, we have a outdoor space for people to enjoy music and also the best farmer's market in town. It extends all the way around this space that's full of beautiful vendors. We've got everything you can think of. Vintage clothing, food, vegetables. Where can you find homemade licorice? Where are you gonna find bone marrow for your dog? It's right here. We're able to um, provide our delicious produce, our different products, and just be able to connect with people. Mid-City offer that opportunity, the people, the music, the food, just the different vendors. It's amazing. So. We um, are excited about being there and just growing and see what opportunity um, we can continue to explore and work with them. So since the market at Mid-City has done such a good job advertising and getting the word out, more people are wanting to join the market. And what's cool is when there's more vendors, more customers come, which means more vendors come. So I'm looking forward to this market growing. And I already know that the market at Mid-City has big plans and they're working very hard for it to grow. If you looked at my bakery and me, where I was when I started at Mid-City in March 2021 to when the farmer's market ended in November, at the beginning of the season, pretty much no line, didn't know a lot of the customers, and by the end of the season, you can really see your growth by the line. It was really fun that I was almost frustrating to people the line that got in the way. It's a family place and because it's a destination place, but we don't have to go out and actually yank on people and customers to come. They're flowing there by the droves because they have so much to offer. I love playing here at the camp. The music we provide is a variety of music, all the way from blues to country to rock and roll to hip hop to jazz to soul, funk. We don't do opera. Most places you go to usually kind of have a genre. They like, it's a rock bar, or it's a country bar, or, you know, not the camp. The camp is good music. I also always really look forward to listening to the band every Sunday. They are so cool. They play rock type music and blues type music. They also say you can give requests and they'll do that. What's really awesome about the art, the bands too, is they'll do shout outs to the local businesses. We care about them, they care about us. Um, being at the farmer's market has been awesome for us, especially at Mid-City Farmer's Market. I think our re revenue increased by um, around 60%. Uh, it, it was a dramatic increase okay. in revenue just being there. Um, if, if you're not familiar with Mid-City, you need to go ahead and Google it Google the camp, look it up, because this is an awesome place. This shows off Huntsville in its true light. It's a melting pot of cool people, and it's a very mellow vibe. So if you know somebody, you invite them to town, bring them here.